Judia de mim Judia Eu não sou merecedor Desse amor Se eu choro Será que você não notou? É a você que eu adoro Carrego esse meu sentimento Sem ressentimento É, é Judia de mim oh, Judia. Judia Eu não sou Welcome to the dance school of uh, Espaço Cultural from the Brazilian teacher Juliana Braga. Tudo bem? Tudo bom. Uh, this school uh, is formed about two years ago from Juliana, and um, I want to ask Juliana because it's a summer school. What is summer precisely? Samba, it's a rhythm that's coming from Africa and the original name was Semba, that means belly, the nafo, and the people were always dancing with swing and rhythm. And then the evolution from Samba is quite long story, but in the end the instruments that make now the Samba, it's a mix because the Atabak is from Africa. The Heku Heku, it's an Indian instrument. The Cavaquinho, it's something European from, from Portugal. And what else? Pandeiro from Turkey. So it's a mix that was created in Brazil. Then evolu the evolution was for the Samba Canção and Bossa Nova. And this goes melody only Batucada from Carnaval. So it's a long story, but Samba came from Africa from, with the slaves and stay, and it's a very roots, popular rhythm from Brazil. Yeah, because I think sometimes European people make Samba with salsa, it's no salsa. Uh, what do you teach? What kind of Samba do you teach in your school? I teach Samba solo, that they call it here Samba solo, but in reality it's Samba Batucada, Samba no Pé, alone, all kind of evolutions, very roots, because I like to mix the more modern and also stay in the roots. So samba de roda, that they play in capoeira, also samba, samba solo, samba de gafieira, that it's then together, it's a saloon dance, full of rhythm and, and I teach also bolero, that I like very much, and for home. I wanted to ask, when did you start dancing and why did you start dancing? I started dancing when I was out of my mama's belly, I think. <laughs> I don't know, I was dancing from very small and dancing all the time, dreaming and passing like this and like that. And then when I was 10, my mother, she had a very good, I think, mother instinct to put me in a modern dance school because I had a very nice... Uh, basis from this because it was a very, uh, how we say, inno inno innovadora. It was in Brazil, the modern dance was contemporary, so we work theater, we work body, um, uh, we touch each other, we did a lot of creations and a lot of studies. Then I started when I was 15, in the same school, they invite me to be teacher, modern dancer. And I had always this samba in my blood that I love. So my father took me to the Gafiera place. Because samba de Gafiera, Gafiera is the place where the people dance. They go, all ages, all, all social classes, and they come together and they talk the same language. <laughs> My dream was to come to Holland because, I don't know, I, I, I have this 
I smell this place and I feel home and I always want to come. So when I came, I started to study other dances, contemporary dances, but I miss my gafiera. So I started to give classes and I was invited to give classes for the folklorish theater here to make some uh, Brazilian dances. So I start to, to develop a work for people here that I don't, I could not die of missing my, so I could develop a work that the people could dance with me and that the people, and everybody like, and I go on and I give classes for children for, in these roots, my, my piece of my land, the piece of my love, I give here. And I think this is... You start from the gancho, so you take gancho and when you make the gun already you do this all. Play, <laughs> keep your sharp and three. Three, finish. Finish in the gancho. I'll introduce or ask Juliana if she like to teach a only mostly gay women group class and so I found some girls and like six weeks now we are having this only women class which I really like and I think you too so maybe is there what what do you think about this <laughs> I love it <laughs> well I have to say that to lead it's something that we have to because we listen more we we have the intuition as a following to go but I always lead because I don't like to depend on no one to lead me. I have a girlfriend in Brazil, a very good friend. We go to dance. If the men invite us, wonderful. If they don't, we have a wonderful time dancing with each other and we change. Sometimes I, f I lead, sometimes she lead. So the group that I have now, women, are very special because it's uh, full of charm and the way that we also can lead, it's completely good, so I'm having a lot of fun and it's wonderful. wonderful.